mobile skills unit is a mobile facility dedicated to supporting the delivery of clinical skills training and education. It's not only a multi-professional unit, it's also multi-agency and it's also open to members of the public. It provides equality of access to training and education throughout the whole of Scotland. I think what the skills unit brings to us is the, the laboratory, if you like, the, the classroom, the place where we can sit and where we can focus on what it is that we need to do and where we can really deliver. The staff can just turn up, they're not on their ward areas where they can be pulled back into um, their day to day work. It's a separate environment and it's got all the resources that we need to run the training and education that um, is required in the remote and rural areas. particularly for the remote and rural areas and some of the islands, it's difficult to um, get to the mainland for training that happens every day within our sort of workplace. If you're in an island setting and someone arrives very unwell at a GP surgery or a uh, community hospital, we may not be able to get there with the best will in the world for two or three hours, so they need to be able to do the stabilisation. The MSU provides that high fidelity simulation uh, through, through mannequins uh, that we can simulate wounds, simulate cardiac arrest, uh, all sorts of different clinical situations. So it's got the up to date mannequins that we use for our training, um, Sim Baby, Sim Junior and Sim Man. If you want extra mannequins put onto it you can ask for that and they'll normally be able to do that. There is a whole broad range of training that can take place on the Mobile Skills Unit. Because it is multi-professional, multi-agency and open to members of the public, um, it, it can vary from training Coast Guards in um, advanced life support and basic life support through to suturing, um, venipuncture, airway management, paediatric emergencies, medical emergencies. The emergency care is, is the thing that really focuses clinicians and the community's minds and I think of all the areas that's the key bit. Scenario training is an extremely powerful way of uh, bringing people together and, and getting people to work as a team. There's a host in each location and they book the mobile skills unit, they contact myself and um, we set up the, the visit. They then put together a training programme based on local training needs within their, within their region. The unit is also utilised by uh, national teams and it works extremely well when the national teams like the Emergency Medical Retrieval Service go out uh, and on location where the unit is and deliver their outreach programmes as well. We've got three cameras on board the mobile skills unit and you are filmed whilst you're in the scenario and what you can then do is you then you're debriefed on how to how the scenario went. The Scottish Ambulance Service, the police, the fire service, the Coast Guards, they can all get involved in being trained on the mobile skills unit. The feedback that we get is that it becomes an event. We've had, you know, we've had children on here, we've had the beavers on here, we've had landladies who, uh, you know, who want to uh, improve their basic life support skills. Um, it's involving community. The skills unit comes to Orkney for two week period each year or most years. What we have done in the past is we've, uh, we've built a learning festival around that. What are the needs of the nursing staff, what are the needs of the, the rural GP staff, what are the needs of the hospital staff and how is it that we can, uh, how can we start to think about addressing that. We also through the outreach visits it enables us to develop those lines of communication so that when we do go and retrieve a patient, very often you will know all the people that are there because you've actually met them as part of the, part of the outreach visit. You know, something that actually I know other places are looking at and, and using something very similar. And it, it really does help glue those different aspects of the NHS together. The MSU is essential to our work. Uh, the environment that, we, that it offers us, the facilities, the consistency, um, it does make you wonder how we used to manage without it. <laughs>